Hello guys, Tao here from Epic Preview Escape, and today we're making another app review, and this time of the 8mm camera app, uh, which is also used in a documentary researching for Sugarman, uh, which got Oscar nominated, I do believe. Uh, or it might have even got an Oscar, I don't even know. Um, um, I haven't really seen it yet. Uh, but yeah, we, we're gonna try it out today, and uh, I, I gotta say, it looks really nice. It's supposed to be kind of an, uh, a Super 8, uh, kind of a, an old school vintage look to, to the movies. I actually think there's some kind of uh, sound as well when you're recording. Uh, like a motor engine thing run, running in, in the camera, of course. Uh, we're going to take a little look on the filters uh, they, they provide. And uh, yeah, see if it's good or bad. And yeah, we, this filter we have right now is called X-Pro. Uh, we're going we're gonna to change it up a bit. We got a filter called Sakura, and as you can see, they all look a bit vintage. We got a truck coming by. Can we hit it? Mm. Yes, we can. Um, actually, quite nice weather today as well. So, yeah. uh, we got a 70s here. Looks a bit, <laughs> a bit like the 70s, I guess. Uh, we got a red car as well. Uh, we got the, the filter called 1920 right here, and as you can see, it <laughs> looks like it's filmed from the 1920s. Uh, looks really old. Uh, Sienna. Here we go. Uh, I think that is quite uh, sad about this. Well, uh, a bit unfortunate is that it doesn't doesn't really have that good fo or good of a focus, uh, which is quite. Uh, but well, it's kind of a, the effect I mean, uh, because yeah, as you can see, uh, it's supposed to be be old school, and old school cameras didn't really have focus as we have now. Uh, here we have Tucson, also really nice. Uh, looks a bit, uh, a bit vintage as well, of course. They all do. Um, yeah, we're gonna look on indigo. Uh, quite a bit, uh, a blue tint to it. If you can snow here, somebody's walking here. Hmm. Weird. Um, yeah, uh, it looks really cool. And uh, we also got Pila, which had <laughs> quite a bit yellow look to it. It's also really nice. Uh, can you do a lot of cool uh, movies with these actually. Uh, we, all, we also have the 60s which is a bit colorful. Uh, looks really really cool actually. We also have uh, Noir which is kind of the old uh, old school uh, movie uh, as he recorded movies with before uh, a real long time ago. And uh, back to X-Pro again. Uh, also we have a different kind of uh, uh, things to it. We, as you can see right now, we just have a plain uh, 16 by 9 uh, wide widescreen uh, display thingy. Uh, we can also choose kind of a kind of a uh, how do you say a framed thing to it, uh, which also looks really nice. It looks a bit old school. Uh, we also got this, which looks like it, it's a it's a film thingy, and when you move it, it actually moves as well, which is really cool. Uh, here we go. <laughs> a bit of a actually a bit of 3D actually. It looks really nice. I wonder if it actually works uh, 3D. Uh, we can try that out maybe. I uh, also got this one which I really like. It's my favorite. Uh, there's like a thing, thing on the left here which makes if you do this quite a lot, it makes the like an orange tint up there uh, resembling the sun, I guess. And it, I really like it. It looks really nice. Uh, we also have like kind of a fisheye thingy. Uh, going on right here, a round thing, uh, which is really nice as well. And uh, yeah, back to this a bus. Look at that. That's what I go. The bus, my bus. I go to school with. Uh, we also got a couple of effects. Uh, you can choose uh, the mic if you want to have like on only one mic uh, or two mics, uh, as it is on the iPad Mini. I'm using the iPad Mini as well. And you can also choose if you want to record with HD, as I'm doing right now. And uh, one of the effects is actually you can press. A button right here, and it will, it will make this kind of a a, a film, old school film thing, popping up, which looks really cool. Uh, here's in all in all of them. They all have like little different things. It's really nice. I really like it, and yeah, I do really recommend this. It's about two dollars, I think, and uh, it's available on the App Store. I don't really know if Android has it. I'm gonna check yeah, that. If out. you like this video, please give it a like, and uh, see you later.